Hey friends, how's it going? So I installed a wacky mod on Minecraft that randomizes every drop. So whatever you destroy, it doesn't drop what it should. Instead, it drops something that you really, really don't need. My ultimate goal is to find diamond. Let's give it a go. I don't know why I do this to myself. This is a timed challenge, so I'm going to embarrass myself in front of all of you. Wait a second, why is it started? Have we started? This doesn't seem fair. We are going to pick this up and see what we get. We got... <laughs> A fishing rod, wheat, and some rotten flesh. Wait, so will sand always give me this? Oh my god, it's give, it's actually giving me decent stuff. Is that a treasure map? <laughs> Should I follow it? <laughs> I need wood to make a boat, I guess. But how do I get wood? Wood? <laughs> What is this? This is blackstone. Okay, that seems to drop from sugarcane every time. <gasps> One of those portal things. Okay, let me see if there's any chests there. Nothing. <laughs> okay, what happens if I destroy the chest? Can I actually pick it up? I got a single oak plank. Okay, not what I needed. Netherrack gets me nothing. Maybe that's because I don't have a pick, but how the hell am I supposed to get a pick? Oh my god, it's starting to feel like I'm in some parallel universe or something. I bet there's a parallel universe with a Kevin playing normal Minecraft. Hey there friends, Burger Kevin here, and I'm using a mod to make Minecraft normal today. I don't know why I do these things to myself. Oh, <laughs> uh, I love meat plants straight from the ocean. Mmm, fresh. We'll just destroy these for now and hopefully build a little house with what it's giving me. I got 40 blackstone, that's not bad. I can technically harvest blocks. All I gotta do is destroy the top layer and let the blocks grow on the lower sugar cane. What a weird sentence. Oh, that's just solid blocks of gold. <laughs> My inventory is so confused. What the hell is that? A great candle. <laughs> Alright, so I get great candles by destroying lily pads. Oh, oh, can I, can I make planks out of slabs? Oh, damn it, I can't put these back into planks. I was hoping I could make slabs into planks. That would have solved my issue since leaves are slabs. Wait, where did I get this plank again? I, I honestly cannot remember where I got this single plank. I remember there was sand, but... Oh, <laughs> Jesus, that's a lot of drops. I got an emerald. Apparently treasure maps are very common for me when I dig up sand. <laughs> I'm getting so many maps. I have four different treasure maps. I don't, I don't know what to do with this information. Oh, um, more meat plants. Being a vegetarian just got a lot more complicated. But hey, it could be worse. You could be a sentient burger in another dimension that only eats people, but is people intolerant. Uh, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Sorry about that. Be sure to subscribe on your way out. <laughs> Wait, is that wood? Stripped warped stem. What the hell does that mean? It can, warped planks. Perfect. Yes, I have my supply. Just took a while to figure it out. Okay, it's getting dark. Time to... Oh, build a house. It's all right. I'll just build a foundation on this sand. Oh, no, I just realized if I place anything, I can't pick it up again because I don't know what a pickaxe is. There we go. My nice little quaint solid gold house. Oh, the ugliest door of all time. Perfect. That'll go perfect with my tacky gold house. <laughs> Honestly, inventory management is becoming a big problem. I can't, I can't keep track of everything because everything's just thrown in at random. Just random junk constantly. Oh god, there's a lot of hostiles out there. Oh no. There we go. You'll never shoot me through my tiny little windows, will you? Wait, they drop candles now. What? I don't know how to light them. <laughs> oh god, I just wasted another- Wait, and then the candle dropped as a bed? What? Oh no, it dropped this black wool. Okay, perfect then. Because then I place a torch, I pick it up, <laughs> I put down a candle, I break that, it turns into wool, I do it again, and then I can make a bed. <laughs> what a roundabout way of doing things. So I guess what I've learned is I can place random things by combining materials I already have to see what'll happen when that breaks. So I got more slabs there. In in that case, that was pretty pointless, but I'll put them up there. My house looks like if a five-year-old drew it. <laughs> so I could get loads of gold bars from that, and then I could make some lovely shoes. <laughs> I'm just fully tricked out in gold <laughs> that I pulled off trees. <laughs> this is so weird. I need more wood. Where the hell did I get wood from? I can't, I can't remember where I got it from. <laughs> it's so difficult. I have gold pressure plates. That's how fancy my house is. Wow. Of course, that does let any monster just walk in if they really want to. Okay, I'm going to sleep and hopefully I'll awake from this wild fever dream. <laughs> I am struggling so much trying to figure things out. I think I'd like to get a boat because then I can sail around looking for villages. And they might actually have items or trade with me so I can actually get proper things. It was grass. That's what I destroyed to get wood, wasn't it? Yes. I... Th 
No? <laughs> then I realized that killing things also drops random blocks, which I didn't think would be the case. Okay, this gives me a lot of candles, which, what do they do again? Nothing. Oh yeah, I forgot. Okay, get rid of all of these. I don't need ambiance. Oh, it was lily pads, wasn't it? No, that's, that's a candle. <laughs> ah, it was those. Okay, yes, that, that stuff. I don't know what it actually is and I can't figure it out because it's just dropping wood for me. Look at this treasure trove. There's just loads of meat just floating in the water. Okay, we've plenty of wood now. Now I can make a boat. Out of curiosity, what happens if I just pick up some of this wood? Nothing. <laughs> I gotta stop being curious. <laughs> Look at my awful house. <gasps> I can make a furnace out of blackstone. Perfect. Now, 59 raw pork chops that I found in a pond. Mmm, soggy meat. Wait, can I not make a boat out of warped planks? Why not? <laughs> I guess it does sound kind of irresponsible. Okay, in that case, I either need to figure out where I can get a different type of wood or a pickaxe, one or the other. No wonder I was catching nothing when I was fishing when there's just meat floating all over the ocean. The fish are full, goddammit. They don't want any more bait. Okay, a flower I haven't seen yet. Let's break that. A ladder. Uh, all right, maybe you could come in handy. I don't know. I'll take it while I can get it because I'm never going to remember how to get it. And if you kill pigs, you get stairs. Awesome. I should have guessed since, well, they do tend to stare a lot. Ooh, what have I found? Like, I know it's a mushroom, but I don't know yet what it'll give me. Stairs. Awesome. I've only found ladders. And stairs since I came into this damn biome. My favorite Minecraft biome is the stairs biome. Okay, what did that fish drop? A birch trap door, I think. Weird, why was he holding that? Oh, Jesus Christ. I don't think I've ever seen a puffer fish like that, actually. That scared me. I think I see a sunken ship here, which is worth exploring. A few unique blocks in there, I imagine. Not to mention the treasure, even though I, I think I have enough maps already. I'm being a bit greedy. Okay, so trapdoor gives me nothing. Excellent. <laughs> Birch planks gives me... What the hell was that? Lime carpet. Awesome. As if my house didn't look awful enough already. A single dark oak fence. Thank God. <laughs> That's all I can say. Thank God I finally have that. A door gives me meat. Great. Wait, wait, wait. Bring that back. Oh, there's my house. At least it's so obnoxious, it really stands out. What the hell noise is that? Or was that in real life? <laughs> Even if it was, what the hell noise was that? In fact, I should be more worried in that case. Oh, this tree gives you nothing. I'm so disappointed. A block of coal. Ah, well, okay then. Coal actually grows on trees. So in this universe, coal is a renewable energy source. Interesting. I don't know if that's better or worse. <laughs> All I know is I'm going to bed. It's been a long and confusing day. I can't even get inside my house. <sighs> ah, new day, new confusions. <laughs> what? what do I do now? I guess I could try putting down everything that's actually destroyable to see what I can get from them. Okay, so we got a fence post, sugar cane, sugar cane to <laughs> destroying the landscape. Now what about this? The hell is that? Waxed, exposed, cut copper. You know, I think I've realized what the problem is. Minecraft is too many blocks. <laughs> What is that? Stripped birch log. Okay, I can make birch wood, but how the hell did I make that? It's just such a random assortment of items, one after the other. Okay, I got wool from one of these, right? I, was it this? Was it gray wool? And that, Yes! Okay, I found the combination. I'm gonna leave that there so I remember how to make wood. You know, around here, I really started to feel like a caveman because I was just trying to figure things out. I was like, oh, ooga, sticks. Booger stones and <laughs> just trying to figure out how the world works. Okay, <laughs> this is so useless. We need to get rid of some of our things. Now I actually, I, I remember how hard Minecraft is. When you're first starting out, you've no idea, but at least you can Google <laughs> what everything does. Damn it, I forgot my wallet in the house. There we go, <laughs> just in case I come across a village. The thing is, judging what I found in that chest, guessing chests just don't have that great loot. Oh, speak of the devil, there's another shipwreck. All right, let's give them a second chance. Let's see what you got for me. Leather. Wow. <laughs> uh oh. It was in this moment that I realized I was in danger of drowning. The important thing is, in a situation like this, you gotta remain calm. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. What is happening? Why am I stuck? What? 
I got in here fine. How come I can't get out? Oh, Jesus. Okay. Eat that meat. Eat that meat. I would have been able to get up sooner if I didn't have a metric ton of meat on me weighing me down. Okay, not worth risking my life for two leather. Lesson learned. I'm not going back down. Oh, gravel. I haven't tried that. In fact, I don't have a shovel. I should make a shovel. Oh, that's right. I can't pick up my feckin' crafting bench. Don't worry. I have a jungle sign instead. Great. <gasps> a village. Imagine just someone approaching from the darkness in the rain, just eating raw meat as they walk towards your village. Okay. I gotta pretend to them that I'm like a god. Watch me turn your wheat into... Nothing. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> yeah, now I'm just destroying their homes for no reason. Hey, what do I get if I destroy a bed? Interesting. Oh, far more interesting than you believe, past Kevin. You'll find out soon. Thanks for letting me stop by. What is this? Light blue glazed terracotta. That'll look just awful in my house, which is exactly the vibe I'm going for. Thank you. Oh, an enchanting table. <laughs> I don't even know what I destroyed. What do I get from this? Maybe I should be trying to destroy rare blocks like that. Like their workbenches and tools and livelihoods. Hey, what do you sell, by the way? Oh, he doesn't want to talk to me after I destroy his livelihood at home. What a prude. <laughs> Purple slab? I was gonna say purple slab, but that wouldn't be purple English. Ah, uh, like that bell, for example. That would be a good one to destroy. No, it wouldn't. <laughs> I got a pressure plate. All right, I have like one house to go. I gotta remember not to destroy all the beds because I need a place to sleep, of course. I don't care about them. Oh, how did I get coal again? No, oh, I can't remember. What was the block of coal that I could get earlier? I could be rich. Ah, well, okay then. Coal actually grows on trees. Right, for now, I'll, I'll take as many as you can give me. I can't even remember how I got emeralds. Wait, didn't I get emeralds just destroying sand? <laughs> They're not that valuable, actually. Lime green concrete powder. How specific? Let me see what I can make out of this sand <laughs> in which I can get emeralds from maybe no I got some coal though oh iron and some coal we can figure out what they give us that would be good to know okay nothing is cool too I really love getting absolutely no progress whatsoever okay coal drops what looks like just a normal block dead bubble coral block Jesus never heard of it I kind of gotta know what does killing a villager do <laughs> no come on it's for science come back the they didn't drop anything. All right, well, violence is not the answer. Who could have known? This guy immediately took his job. You see, I'm creating jobs. What is this, by the way? <laughs> what do I get if I destroyed this? An apple. No, it's a candle. Never mind. I can still eat it, though. It says non-toxic. What would destroying a beehive get me? Oh, it's getting bees very angry. That doesn't feel very random at all. Bees are afraid of water, right? I can go into water. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Are we okay? Oh, we are okay. Military genius, back at it again. Okay, killing a horse gets you nothing but bad feelings and a little pain in the head from that awful noise they make. I don't think I've ever intentionally killed a horse in Minecraft. Ah, there we go. There's no place like home, luckily for all of you. <laughs> In fact, may as well make use of this jungle sign. No place like home, thankfully. <laughs> what an endearing little message to come home to. All right, let's get placing some of my furniture. This is my bedside table now. <laughs> this is basically like an audiobook. It reads to me. Everything I know about women I learned from my tractor by Roger Welsh. Chapter 1. I know nothing about women, please help me. The end. Uh, I'm tempted to just destroy these really weird blocks I found, as funky as they are. I want to know what they give me. Wow. I got stripped dark oak wood and pumpkin. <laughs> Yeah, that was worth it. The hell is this? A big drip leaf. Okay. <laughs> can I, oh, you can stand on that? Interesting. Not interesting enough to keep, though. What does it... Oh, light blue carpet. Jesus. Okay, that's staying there. <laughs> Just making my house worse as this video goes on. May as well get the lime carpet down. Oh, heavy weighted pressure plate. Why not? Yep, there you go. <gasps> I found diamond! I did it! And along with diamond horse armor, too. All achieved in just under an hour. Which, by the way, is a world record because no one else has attempted this, but that's still a world record. It was cracked slate. How the hell did I make that, though? Oh, no, I cannot remember. I'd have to actually go back and see what I destroyed. Aha! It was an orange bed. That's what got me diamond. And there I was just trolling all these villagers for no reason. But actually, it was the key to my success. Anyone else got an orange bed? <laughs> I've destroyed so many of them. 
Oh, Jesus, they've resorted to killing themselves. <laughs> I guess I have made their life misery. I destroyed all their beds and food sources for no reason. <gasps> Orange bed! Uh, I didn't get diamond, but I got something even better this time. The gift of fire. Congratulations, you've all been lit alight and sacrificed to the orangey gods in the hopes that I might get more diamond. Ah, oh, ah, oh, no, I've been sacrificed too. Oh, no, where's the water? Why do bad things happen to good people? Ah, no! <laughs> I deserved that so much. Okay, a very fitting and happy ending for the villagers. Not so much for me. But I found diamonds, so you know what? I died a rich man. And I'm, I think that's all we can hope for, really. Dying rich. Uh, that's the dream. Leave me some feedback, whether it's good or bad. I try and read as much as I can. Thank you so much, and I hope to see you next time. Bye for now.